Hi guys, uh, welcome to Trading in Zones. Uh, I've been watching a lot of uh, stuff happening on uh, YouTube, so I thought this is uh, something which has become a trend where you know everyone's trying to talk about the other person and trying to get the strategies out. So I thought you know it's a hot topic cooking, so why not uh, talk to all of you and you know uh, make some video as well. So one of the first things which I saw is that one of the most happening keywords uh, as of now is that if you uh, you know, just try to search exposed, you'll, you'll start getting to see things like, okay, 60k strategy is now free, uh, zero the exposed, uh, Sunil Miglani exposed, and, and all these, uh, you know, people are trying to kind of go and, you know, share those strategies and, and stuff like that. To be honest with you, <clears throat> you know, uh, everyone who's trading, uh, would know, I mean, at least everyone who's trading for a pretty long time would know that losses are inevitable and mostly they are looking for people uh, whom they can just fool uh, by saying that, you know, there are strategies available and we can do stuff for you, etc, etc. Because, uh, you know, there is no one uh, as such who can uh, give you an assurance of a certain method of uh, trading uh, working forever right so let's think a little uh, logically right so if there was something which is available for all of us to tap into and and work on it the question is uh, why is it not there with anyone till date right that is the first question and the second question is if it is with someone till date by now, everyone would have got to know that he or she has it. They might not have known what that strategy is, uh, but I'm sure they would have known. Or if someone did build uh, something fantastic, that would have been sold to some big bank, to some big company, that, that would have been in news uh, all over the place. You know, uh, something like that would have definitely come out. If someone has made a strategy, if someone has made a bot, uh, if someone has made something else and they're trying to sell it to you, one thing what you need to ask yourself, if trading was so easy, if trading was so predictable, if trading had no emotions involved, uh, no people's behaviors involved, stock behaviors, company behaviors, news, etc, etc, a lot of other factors, right? So if nothing was involved at all, then... Uh, you know, it would be so mechanical in nature that everyone would know that they press a button and and, the, and a buy would happen and they press a button and a sell would happen and they would be uh, making a lot more money. So the question is, why are some people uh, trying to fool you and how are they trying to fool you, right? So some of the easiest ways to uh, provide uh, or make people believe is uh, showcasing some amount of profits because we all get tempted with uh, some kind of money uh, which we see so eventually uh, you end up getting tempted because I show you my profits but I never show you my losses and I'll say you know a number of things in terms of uh, how much of money I'm making uh, I will show off probably with my vehicles you know anything which would make you believe that i'm making a lot of money uh, but i would never truly try to share the knowledge with you because if anyone tells you that it is not very easy to trade uh, you would never go to him or her in the first place so you know they always work on your mind where they make you believe that it's easy money they make you believe that you can become a billionaire overnight and they make you believe that you can solve all your financial problems and you know become rich overnight and make so much of money that no one else is uh, kind of making and we all kind of get looped uh, into it and you know we all kind of get uh, kind of caught into it and then we start thinking that yeah you know what it's very easy you know uh, they just give calls i just need to trade on them and i make money this is exactly the same thing which people in Indore are feeding with. This is exactly the same thing 
every other uh, trainer uh, who's in the market is feeding on every other person who's offering you a service is feeding on they're all feeding on your weakness of trying to make money right let's first agree once we are really disciplined with how we are managing our money we will be much more better in terms of what we are already earning and even if you see some of the biggest of the people who have made a lot of money they are all investors who started way long back in their career and they started very small they kept investing they believed in the companies which they invested their money in and then they were able to make significant amount of money over a period of time and none of them are like you know two years six months right or one year in the uh, trading uh, system who have made millions of rupees and these guys have taken decades gone through multiple market cycles uh, have have had significant amount of losses uh, if you read about them uh, they will talk about significant amount of losses they've had before they also talk about significant amount of losses they've had now so it's very funny to you know look at some of these things which uh, which are coming up and then uh you know every person is trying to expose the other person and you know they are and then there are fans for each of these uh, people and 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 they think that you know uh, one of the easiest part to attract people on youtube and get many people to like or share or anything is just you know expose some of the strategies and in fact i keep telling people that if you want to go ahead and talk about everything what i have been teaching please go ahead and talk because there is no one way to market you know i wish i could tell people that oh okay there is a mscd crossover so just go and buy oh okay there is a, a divergence happening just go and buy it doesn't work that way and it does fail multiple times every single strategy what you would read uh would fail at certain uh, point in time because markets are completely random the outputs are completely random so there is no way one can you know truly have that uh, strategy and all these things are complete nonsense which i would you know to be honest ask you to avoid if you know we are a few different kinds of people right uh maybe i am someone who would want to learn trading uh, myself uh i would want to understand my strengths and weakness and then you know figure out what works best for me from my mindset and i really want to put the effort to learn and then there will be some people who will be like mm, na you know i'll probably opt for a call service who's consistently giving me a good buy and sell whether it is positional or whether it is intraday uh you know it's much easy for me to just follow someone's call and they opt for call services and then there will be some people who will say you know mutual funds are much better you know i would go there some people will say investment is the best part uh, i will go there uh, some people will say i will never take risk with stock markets i'll keep my uh, money safe and all that good stuff so uh end of the day what we need to understand is we all have a certain risk appetite we all have a certain mentality we all have a certain type of thinking right and based on that thinking there are people who are offering you multiple different stuff so you need to choose uh, what's best for you and not really divulge into all these kind of activities where you are trying to pull a fast one on someone else you know trying to put someone else's strategy out on youtube and say this is exposed and all these things are just purely done so that they can grab attention of uh, people who are you know coming there and you know uh, if if any trainer is just asking you to uh, make a buy because a certain combination of indicators are asking you to buy if it was that easy if it was uh, that easy you know you need to just think about it by now everyone who's come into stock market for last uh, you know decades together would have all tried everything what these guys are actually talking about right and most of them uh, who are good at trading uh, who are trading from a long period of time would always talk things on not on strategies but you know trying to more understand yourself as as a trader figure out what you're good at figure out what you're bad at 
and then you know develop skills over a period of time and then most importantly follow a, a disciplined uh, routine have a strong trading plan and follow uh, your plan in terms of how you want to trade what kind of a market condition you know what kind of a stock you want to pick uh, to trade and consistently repeat your success so that over a period of time you become profitable but would that mean you know it is a holy grail and everyone can uh, start making money no because you know uh, you and me the risk appetites might be different you know i can probably afford to lose uh, you know 20 30 30 grand or maybe i can afford to lose a few lakhs but maybe 1000 rupees is big money for you in your life right so it, it all depends on you know what kind of background we come from how much of money makes a difference for us in our life at the current financial situation all those things really make a big difference so what one needs to understand is that don't heed into you know these kind of stuff whether you know it comes online and then people spend hours together reading comments on these people they start throwing muck on each other they waste their time and then there are people wasting time you know you need to understand that you can better utilize this time by reading a book uh, by probably you know spending some more uh, time on understanding what the charts are telling you uh, you know even if it is kind of a paper trade or a mental trade you want to do because you know you see a chart and you think it's going to move up you think it's going to move down you want to make an observation over a period of two three days a week or two you want to see uh, whether your observations are enhancing whether your probabilities are becoming better you know you can spend a lot of time on stuff which which makes more sense than trying to go through all these videos of you know each other trying to throw muck on each other and trying to you know uh, pull a fast one so that they can get more customers at the end of the day because see all they want is more people uh, coming to them uh, and giving them you know their money uh, if they are doing a portfolio management or uh, if they are doing training they want you to join their training and all of them are trying to show you some kind of profit screens they are trying to fool you around right if it was that easy uh, why do we even have anyone struggling right so i will leave you with that question a point to ponder think about it and take proper decisions because all one needs to understand is that he or she has multiple ways to make money. Uh, he or she can take a decision in terms of what they want and what they don't want. And uh, he or she uh, needs to decide uh, what's best uh, for them, uh, you know, in terms of uh, understanding that uh, there is no holy grail in stock market. Mutual funds go wrong, big banks uh, go wrong. Uh, you know most of them goes wrong I mean there is no one who can be uh, as precise I mean some of the best uh, fund houses who have given the best returns uh, whether it's a mutual fund or uh, whether it's a portfolio management company uh, they have all gone through uh, losses you know we have some of the biggest investors we have seen like uh, Rakesh Jinjinwala or Aparinju doing multiple mistakes and coming on interviews and saying that yeah you know we gauged it wrong and we were uh, probably completely wrong in terms of what we are doing so some of the best portfolio managers have who are you know probably running I don't know how many thousand crore accounts have come out and uh, mentioned that you know uh, they have gone wrong in their assessment so we are all humans and, and there is no uh, such thing uh, what people keep looking for uh, right so majority of us uh, go wrong because we get tempted uh, because of the screenshots uh, because of the statements or because of those uh, profit screens whether they show live or offline we we get uh, we get caught in that loop so do you really want to get caught in that loop what do you really want is the question you need to ask yourself and uh, based on your uh, you know uh, needs or interests you need to take your decision and you need to be very uh, caution where you're going to put in your hard-earned money right whether it's into a stock market whether it's into a portfolio management service or whether it's into uh, a trainer or whether it's into a call service it really does not matter but what matters is uh, what do you want right and are you really getting what you want or are you just getting trapped because uh, you see some kind of a, a screen being projected by someone which shows a lot of money 
and do you really understand the reality is that the outputs are random right so think about it and and take an informed decision when you're entering stock market when you're trying to exit stock market or when you're trying to fight through and live through the stock market whatever you're doing try to take an informed decision take care i hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend uh, just wanted to come out and you know make sure that i talk to all of you and pass the message on that it's not easy and it's not that it is difficult but you need to put in a lot, a lot of effort if you want to do it by yourself and if you really want to go for a good service find the best in the industry right don't go and uh, waste your time and money on people who are just trying to throw muck on each other and they are not going anywhere so right use your time for something good uh use your time for something better and i'm sure uh, you will find uh, a lot more stuff happening the way you expected it to happen than you know uh sitting and uh, watching some of these uh, strategy videos which will not lead you anywhere end of the day all right take care see you guys have a wonderful wonderful weekend take care bye